There you go. Right, right on the quad bike. Hey guys and welcome back to a brand new video and in this video I just want to have a little wander down the promenade and see what is happening on this lovely evening it's about 6 30 on a Wednesday and it is looking quite busy as you can see we've got the sun out but the heat have cooled down a lot since from earlier this afternoon so let's just get on with the video they offer traffic jam down the promenade. Just right at the side of the Sanningans. I just seen two youths riding like some kind of dirt bike. It seems to see definitely when it busy like this and they're flying up the prom with no helmet or some. Could be very dangerous also. We got Blackpool Tower just right there. And you always know when it's quite busy when the ambulance is on the tram line. So I wonder what is happening. <coughs> I do feel sorry for the emergency services. Definitely when it's busy. But lucky enough, you do have the tram tracks in Blackpool. It looked like Pop has fish and chips still got the scaffold thing up around it. That been up for quite some time now. We got the work tradesmen probably making the way home on a busy day. The tourist information. Is any is anyone want to know what happened in Blackpool before you come up? Just drop a comment down below and I'll try to find out for you. At least you can plan ahead then, instead of coming and just hoping for the best and let something happen in. But the season is in now, so there'll be quite a bit to do. It looks like the sea is coming in, but it's still got a bit of an island with the sand. North Pier just over there in the distance. And we just got the sun popping out of the clouds. And look at all the seagulls just right down on the steps. Better than people eating, that why I didn't hanging around for. The tourist hotspot ain't really looking that busy compared to how we have seen it in the past couple of days. Or less than just enjoying a lovely walk down the promenade while we got this nice weather we haven't really for the past couple of days now we even got a skater on the comedy carpet as people know me as two skaters on the comedy carpet they're very ideal with this spot for skaters probably bust it nice and smooth not why not always come here and skate got the seagulls though just hovering for a bit of food taste of it the greedy little buggers ain't them wonder what this part here for it didn't get in any work done to the roof or Julian just own one out right so they can get to the high up spots got the lifeguard out just right the distance on the beach probably to make sure everyone's safe but as you can tell right next to central pier we've got a bigger beach and not just that island so this is probably why everyone is on this side for. Well, as I could tell, there's quite a few people enjoying it today. We got the big wheel just over in the distance. Contains some life bolts. They probably block all this up so the life bolts can get in and out without people being stood in like the entrance. You got sea life just across. I've been to sea life before and it's up in. They got quite a couple of fish to show. 
My little lad loved it. I have been talking recently, but when he was younger, and he enjoyed all the lights. You got your ice cream trader. But you better you're in quite busy on weather it's like this. That was a little, I've cooled down a lot since this afternoon. But it is still quite warm. Yeah. And it's funny for me, but I know to watch my videos and comments all the time. And he said to like Elvis, so there you go. Thanks for watching and commenting on every video. And we got our other ambulance going up the promenade. But yeah, we got took our happy days over the road. That always seems to be a other busy type of little corner. But I mean, you got your food court, the arcade. And what is this bubble tea what's popping up everywhere? So when you come to Blackpool, which one is your favourite arcade? Ash, let me be honest, you got lots of different amusements down on the promenade. You got Colour Island, you got Golden Mound, you got Funland, you got Happy Days, you got so many different amusements to go into. So which one is your favourite one? You even got Blackpool amusements with the cafe upstairs. But saying that's all, Colour Island, you got a couple of bars in there that sell food. And I saw there will be a couple more. Oh, my foot like to be on that tram today. That tram looking quite busy. I said, bet you in busy on the day and like today. Two minutes after when I said that, and you got customers. Been a lion looking quite busy. Definitely for a weekday. First thing first, I don't want to take this moment to say a great big thank you for everyone who has supported this channel so far. It is really much appreciated. When I first started this channel, I never thought it would grow on as quick as it did, shall I say. So I am very grateful. And if you wish watching this and um, you do like the type of content, then please don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on that notification bell so you don't miss any upcoming videos. And if you do have like somewhere where you want to see in Blackpool, then please let me know down below in the comments and I'll try and do it. I'm always looking for video ideas. Hey, look how we got that ambulance just right next to North Pier. So let's go have a look, let's hope no one is hurt. I'm still wondering what is going to be taking the resolution space. It is quite a big unit to cover up. So what is going to go there after when the resolution explodes it does? I have mentioned this in one of my previous videos, but you got Robert's Oyster Bar. It, you don't really see that many anymore really on the promenade anyway like fresh oysters type of bar type of unit now like i said the ambulance right at the side and up here it looked like they sat in there so it might be like um respite is parking for them so in close to the promenade and everywhere else in town and of course we have got Dolly just behind Pop World and this is a popular place for the homeless to sit underneath there and have a sleep it do look like they cleaned it up a bit so I know it went months and months and months without anything getting done and here we got a big empty building just doing nothing I've been told they keep getting squatters in there but is that the people thought is they got nowhere to go and if they see an empty building of course they don't to make their way in to get themselves up the streets for a few hours you got a central library just over in the distance and the museum just at the side of it working for the rat race you know you're wasting your time 
Oh, I wonder what that about. What did the old library used to be? Well, so we got something in the brick work right there saying juvenile entrance. So work used to be at old courts. Because it'd be a bit weird them putting juvenile entrance on like a building like this. It looked like they fixed this sign now. Well, on the way from fixing it, there's no um, logo or the shop name on there at the minute. But well, at least it looked like it fixed a problem. <laughs> right then guys, I think that's done by the end of this video. But you did enjoy this like, walk around and please give it a big thumbs up. If you want to see more videos like this one, hit the subscribe button. And you don't want to miss any upcoming videos, then turn on the notification bell. I'll see you on the next one.